Hello everyone. Today I'll be making the wing sections of the drone. I'm designing a 3D model of the internal wing frame, taking into account the placement of other components and the possibility of running wires through it. The frame parts will be made of 1.5mm 3-layer plywood using laser cutting. For the skin, I'll use the carbon shells I made earlier. Inside, there's space provided for a carbon tube. It will be used to attach the arms with the motor propeller units to the wing. These, in turn, will be used for vertical takeoff and landing. Due to my limited practical experience with vacuum infusion, it's not always possible to achieve a perfect vacuum. At the location of the tube, the fabric separated from the mold, which led to resin buildup. That also caused a local deviation of the actual part dimensions from the design. I had to mechanically remove the excess material to ensure a proper fit of the parts. The wing will be glued together inside fiberglass molds. To make connecting the motor propeller units easier, I integrated mounts for electrical connectors into the wing. I made these mounts using 3D printing. According to my plan, the connectors should fit into the mounts with a slight interference. The wings will be attached to other parts of the airframe using carbon tubes integrated into the frame. Grooves are also provided in the mold for the guide tubes. This should ensure sufficient alignment accuracy of the frame tubes for proper fitting with the fuselage. I glue the wing parts together using epoxy resin with a filler made of glass microspheres. I fasten the molds with bolts and place them at an angle so that the leading edge of the wing is facing downward. Under gravity, the resin should flow toward the edge bases for a stronger bond. I leave it for a couple of days for the resin to cure. Then I disassemble the molds and remove the part.
I remove the excess resin from the wing surface with a utility knife. I slightly level the end faces of the wings and remove sharp edges. Gaps have formed in some areas along the joint of the leading edges. Some resin leaked onto the front surface of the wing. A pocket was formed there due to the carbon fabric detaching from the mold during vacuum infusion. I didn't take this into account and applied too little resin in those areas. I mix epoxy resin to glue in the mounts for the electrical connectors and fill the existing gaps. After the resin cures, I perform the final finishing. The connectors will be pressed in later, after the wires are soldered and routed inside the body. <laughs> 